My name is Wu Tao. I'm the founder and the head designer of Kilomet 109, the sustainable fashion label uh, from Hanoi. I genuinely just want to create something from Vietnam, made by Vietnamese, designed by Vietnamese, and using all the local techniques and methods, and also have a experimental elements into it as well. During 1980s, the country very much recovering and we make pretty much everything by ourselves. For the textiles, we also have to make and reuse a lot, recycle a lot, you know, from blanket, from odor. We used to make our own clothes, so we, we know how to make things because we have no choice. We have only two colors which is very popular. Is one is navy, it's the symbolic like, of workers. Another color is brown, but for so long I didn't like that color because it's associated with the past and with my grandma and my grandpa's generation. So it's a very old-fashioned to me. Where I live, I'm surrounded with many craft villages and artisans everywhere. The original idea of working with them is try to find the people who keep their tradition alive and know how to make things in their own ways. When you work with the community and you're so self-central, you're gonna fail badly. Before I working with the artisans, I very often see the designer as the top of the list. I have a only five design team and me is a number six and the design part I can do it in a week or two weeks but the text it takes so long and also so many people involved now it's 35 artisans and so that's why I want to put equally the, the artisan and me and appreciate earlier part of the making process. Yeah, well, fashion industry is, is one of the most polluted and the dark side of the industry is really huge, but for so long nobody talked about that. So the designer really hard to track where the fiber come from and how they make, who made them, where they made. Right now we plan our own dye plants, including Indigo. We decide to have our own field so it's right now we have a 1.5 hectare and that's not including cotton and hams and also silk we plant our own moonberry leaves and raise our own silks when you do that and you learn from everything every corner of the productions it's so fascinating it's a very special privilege thing to have we try to make long last products, but also how is it gonna disappear after we throwing them in the trash. So profit for us is not just money, profit here is, is responsibility. Talent to me is a combination of a lot of things. The awareness about what's around you, the global issues, the social issues. The talent here is also mean activists as well. I love Martin Magella. It's very minimalistic, but it has a really thoughts behind it. He really uh, ahead of the game. My dad is, is the one who influenced me, like the appreciation for beauties. Even just simple, beautiful vase of rose on the tables. Sparkle? Okay, is that perfect? <laughs> really, sparkle.